My name is Søren Solkær. I'm a photographer based in Denmark. For the past 25 years, I've photographed mainly musicians and actors all over the world. Portraiture has been a very important discipline uh, in my work. Det er fedt, det der. Der var den. Det ser fucking fedt ud, det der. Super sejt. Hvad synes du, Alex? Hvad leder du efter, når du, når du ser et af dem, og så er du sådan her? Jeg synes bare, man kan se det. Ja. Der er ikke noget specifikt? Jo, jeg, jeg kigger selvfølgelig på udtryk, lys, komposition. Ja. Når, det, når det hele det falder på plads. Ja. Det her, det er jo... Det er jo rimelig... Hold da kæft, det er så det er så godt. I've shot on many different camera systems during my career. Starting out shooting analog back in the 90s, switched to full frame digital, which I've been shooting for many years. Then medium format digital came along, but for many years that was something that was only usable in a studio environment with a tripod and a lot of lights. My latest camera, the uh, Fuji GFX 100S, suddenly combines the best of both worlds. It's um, an extremely big file, it's more than 100 megapixels, and at the same time it's very versatile, it's no bigger than a full-frame camera. It's something that I carry around and use also for more spontaneous shooting. It's a total game-changer that you get the versatility and the huge file uh, in, the, in the same body. Few different aspects that are important to me when I do a portrait. I try to establish a strong connection to the person I'm photographing. I'm trying to create an atmosphere of intimacy. I'm interested in the inner life of the other person and I'm trying to capture that. At the same time, I'm also interested in lighting the portrait so that there is some sort of artistic edge and style to the portrait. So it's sort of the meeting of feeling and intimacy and something that's a little more edgy. I feel that with my Black Sun project, I have reconnected with nature. A connection that was very strong growing up, but that I cut for several decades. I feel very present when I'm in nature, and also I do feel a strong connection to this natural phenomenon. I need to be extremely present to capture it. It's some sort of a meditation for me to photograph these birds. Seeing my work on paper is very, very different from just seeing it on a screen. I love finding the right paper with the right texture to add the tactile sensation to a photograph. The print can never be better than the quality and the size of your file. The file size becomes crucial. I love to use artificial lights because it enables me to create a mood and an atmosphere and create a cinematic feeling. In most of my adult life I've spent time in big cities because that's what I've been drawn to and that's also where most of my portraiture work has taken place. 
I'm very convinced that I will always be doing portraits for the rest of my career. But I feel a stronger pull to nature and I'm sure that some of my future projects will be nature and travel related. I'm very interested in landscapes, trees and big new horizons.